Get a £5 free bet every week with Offer Club from William Hill. Simply stake a total of £20 or more across the week on pre-match football accumulators with four or more selections and you'll get a £5 free bet on the Friday. Join William Hill Offer Club on mobile or online now. Tie and Booth IFL TV in association with Macklin's in Marbella. I'm at the Doncaster Dome with um, Nick Manners, yeah? And uh, Jimmy Arrington. Jimmy, yeah. I don't mind if you call me Rick. No, you do. <laughs> I, I don't. No, you do. I don't. I know who I am. You know who you are, yeah? <laughs> are you okay with me calling you? Uh... You can call me anything you want. No, I'll try those. and stick to Nick, yeah? That's cool. So you had a boxer on tonight. You had a couple, didn't you? Well, no. I'm, I, I'll, I'll, let me just say this now. Um, as well as working with Josh Warrington, I'm working in association with Freedom Boxing, Jimmy James, we work as a team. Mm. Um, we've got a group of boxers, um, Jimmy's the main man tonight. I'm, I'm garnering a lot, a lot of experience um, and trying to get involved in the game. Jimmy's the main man tonight. Uh, that's, believe it or not, I've won world titles as a trainer or co-trainer. Who have you trained as a world champion? Jamie McDonald. Have you trained Jamie? As, as a co-trainer. Well? As a co-trainer. Not as a main oh, trainer. Seen it, yeah. As a co-trainer with a chap called Dave Bullard. So I've won world titles, European titles, British titles, English titles. And some hero. And that is my only first ever Central Area title. Been involved with Isaac Lowe, won a, a Commonwealth English title with Isaac, won a Masters International with Max Hughes behind you, uh, trained Max Hughes with Dave. Uh, two world titles with Dave Ulley and Jamie McDonald. British title with Gavin McDonald, European. Let's get to tonight. Commonwealth. What happened tonight? It's just, it's just no, it's good. Like, yeah. well, you know, you just you know, you just do it. Yeah, it's alright. Like like his just, CV is his CV. You can go on, can't it? Yeah, but it's just the unsung heroes in boxing. Yeah, yeah. There's not just myself. There's many. What's of going them. on? Let's talk about tonight yeah. then. Let's go tonight. Fight, yeah. Fantastic. What, fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Nobody believed in Josh. Who did you have on today? Josh Morgan. Josh Morgan against who? Stevie Ale for Stevie the Central Area yeah. lightweight title. Yeah. Good. Nobody outside of my circle believed that Josh were going to win that. Mm. I did. Of course I did. A train championship, he's got to believe in himself. Dragged, Dragged him over the line. line. He sat there, now seven, eight, uh, 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 nine. Uh, uh, no, I'm not going to tell him no. Right. But in, yeah. Listen, at the end of the day, it was a hard line. fight. It was yeah. a very hard, hard fight, fight, close fight. Every round contested really, really well. Yeah. There were times when he turned around and questioned whether he was winning or losing or whatever, and we told him, don't business with that, just go out and win the next round. Fight the next Listen round. To fight us. the next round. You know, if a boxer comes to the corner at the end yeah. of the round and says, am I, am I winning? And yeah. he's genuinely losing. Yeah. Do you, are you the kind of trainer who says you're winning to I'll give him confidence? I'll tell the truth. I'll tell the truth. Because you know if you lie and say you're winning, he don't, he'll never believe in you again. He might sort of like hold no, back tell the truth. or it might give him confidence. He'll never believe in you again. What we told again. him was, look, at the end of the day, you keep doing what you're doing, just make sure that if, when you hit him twice, make sure that he only hits you once. Um, if anything, make sure you keep your head in front, nose in front, that's, you know what I mean, and whack him. That's, that's having good people around you running mm. your corner because it's the way you word things. on the things. same page. Yeah, the way the you word page. things to that boxer. Mm. Even if they feel the negativity in themselves, don't let it come to the surface. They're all positive people, aren't yeah. they? You know, don't positive let, people. Don't you let know, some, some people who are home fighters, some boxers who are home fighters, you know, because they've got the crowd like yeah. cheering them on. And yeah. Sometimes they sort of like neglect the, um, you know, the tactics and just try and bring excitement. No, we have the time for that. At the end of the day, you know, well, well, no, Josh no, no, was in the away corner. Mm. Josh didn't have to bring the excitement. Josh didn't have to sell the tickets. Mm. He had to bring the excitement. He had to stick to his game plan, do what we'd worked on in the gym, and listen to us and implement what we wanted him to do. I thought it was fantastic. Yeah. Sorry for the thing. I thought Sorry, it was a fantastic yeah, performance. You know what it is? Um, that Central Area title fight was reminiscent of the old days when there was only the Central Area, the British, the Commonwealth, the European, the world. And I'll tell you what it is. People would fight their heart out just to get that. Let me tell you something. That kid there, Josh Morgan, he will never forget this night again. And the people of Doncaster will probably turn around and uh, they'll be looking at him like he's the world champion. He did fantastic. 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 You know what it is? For a, for a fight there with both fighters, mm. to only have 15 fights between them. Oh, fantastic. And to box like that, 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 that was a quality like that, fight. That, that was a quality fight. Is he from Doncaster? Yeah. The other kid, yeah. He's you from know, it also gives you um, a good experience of. Because you're not going to hit the big time soon enough. Yeah, time, I'm, you know just I mean? a, I'm a rookie. 
rookie. A rookie. A rookie. A, a, a novice. Like oh, well, yeah, but you, you're getting there and your interviewing techniques are getting better and better. You know what I mean? And, you're getting people's names right and that, you know what I mean? They, they directly send me to you, you know, because you're a little character. I'm not a little character, man. Are you always like this or do you yeah, turn I'm around and go to the camera? Yeah, I'm all right. Listen, I'm made for the camera. Are you always I'm, like this? Yeah, yeah, I'm made for the camera. I'm a positive yeah. guy. My name's Nicholas Manners. I am made for the camera. One I like day, it, I will get my place. Yeah. All right, then. All right. You know what? All right. Go on. There's three minutes left on the camera, you know. I want both of your predictions for the Kelbrook Golovkin fight next week. Kelbrook's going to get smoked like a big Havana cigar. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, and I'm, and I'm, I'm not being disrespectful to Scout because I'll tell you what it is by rights from a boxing point of view I don't want to see a welterweight a, a good welterweight go up and be a good middleweight because that's not good for boxing what I'd like to turn around and see is an exceptional welterweight like um, or welterweight like Sugar Ray Leonard was he could go up and be an exceptional middleweight like Hagler because he had the skills and all that business and people could believe in it. Mm. But I don't really see, I'm not into all this bullshit where everybody's blowing smoke up Kel's ass because, uh, no, I mean, nah, man, listen, Kel, you're getting a fantastic payday, you deserve it, you're going to be secure, you and your family for life, and then you can come down, you can bank, bang that, what's his name? I mean, can't. can't, you know what I mean? Yeah. Beat him, beat him, that's all you're going to get, that's where you get your kudos. This is a good wage, and I'm glad you've got it because you deserve it. Nice, you know what I mean? Simple. Oh, you know, right. Final words, final words. Word, mate. Final words before the battery dies. And the to say. Golovkin, what, what, what is it? One final words? I know you have to call the words there. That's Listen, entire. you know what I think is going to happen? I think that Golovkin should, his point should be beating Kel one round earlier than Canelo beat Khan. Because mm, if he right. goes any further than that, you know, it is, it's a disaster. Man is all out. right, thanks for talking to IFL right. TV. Yeah? Nice Man one, yeah. Thank yeah, you very camera's much. Still following me, it's all right, right. man. Don't, 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 don't. Thank you very much. Thanks for that. Thank you very much. See you soon, buddy. Pound free bet every week with Offer Club from William Hill. Simply stake a total of twenty pounds or more across the week on pre-match football accumulators with four or more selections, and you'll get a five pound free bet on the Friday. Join William Hill Offer Club on mobile or online now.